Each episode, just when I think that the development just keeps getting better, my god, it just keeps, keeps, keeps going. What happened last episode? The speech was fantastic. Bro gets a haircut once and he just returned to prime preschool mode. It's funny that this kid that's in middle school already peaked in prime in a elementary school, but hey, he got it back with the haircut. And then the speech was also amazing, but the events that followed after with Yamada rejecting Senpai, oh, so, so peak. Now, things got a little awkward after because, you know, after everyone left in the room, Yamada and Ichika was just in the room alone to kind of take in exactly what she just said. And obviously, she got super flustered and they got out the room. That one girl literally said, did they do it in that short amount of time? Crazy shit. Where the fuck did that line come from? Hey, let's figure out what's going to happen in today's reaction. <laughs> the speech. Wait, did the sister record the speech? Oh, it's going to be. Gonna be cringe, right? It was an amazing speech during the moment, but to replay it, it's gonna be like, oh, I don't want to hear that shit. <laughs> <laughs> the girls already do. <laughs> he already has a harem, kind of, not really. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, what if? What if each guy has a girl that's like gonna be like, wow, senpai so cool, and starts like. Like, I want to ask him out, and then Yamada gets jealous. Like, we literally have a reversal where Kohai asks out Itsuka, Yamada's in the same room, and, and Itsuka looks at the fucking dog and says, Sorry, my hands are too full because I have Wantaro. And <laughs> it's a wrap! <laughs> she wasn't, but that's uncanny. <laughs> Uh, we're back at it. All those progressions, and he still figures out a way. He always figures out a way to be like, but it's not really like that. Mm. That is true. The affection meter is very high right now. This is actually a good concern. What was that? What was that? Watch yourself, bro. The ego is getting out of control, bro. What? What a slut. He gets a haircut once and he thinks he's him. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, with a fan club. What are you gonna do, bro? Is he gonna stalk? He's gonna stalk. Rented out a whole fucking room for himself, bro, just so he can take stock the other group. What, what are you doing? <laughs> she good at singing? She should be good at singing. Wow, Kampai. Everyone Kampai except Yamada. She's never gonna sing at this rate. He's coming, bro. That's so creepy. Oh, they know him. Everybody? Oh, shit. Yo, they think it was so good that we ad-libbed it. Oh, what the fuck? Sister was right. We're just getting invited to the character room. Hey, what? Yamada's gonna see this. What's she gonna think if she sees that, you know, a bunch of ladies are bringing him in? Hmm. What are you doing here? What well, well, kind of, but you got invited later. Alone. Yo. So. I think she's happy that he stalked. Nah, I'm just here for the food. This is true. She did do that after the injury. No, I think that if you actually told her the honest feelings of I felt insecure that you're going with a bunch of dudes and I wanted to stalk because I felt that way, I think she would 
take that as a compliment. At this stage, like, you can't do that in the beginning when you barely know a girl. That's creepy as fuck. But there are some things that you can do when you're at this stage of the game and both sides love each other so much. In fact, in f the creepiness somehow shows that you are that much into the person that I think it would pay off. Oh. Oh. Maybe. <laughs> Haven't heard this soundtrack in a while. <laughs> of course. It was the same room. There is no soundproof windows. You were like five years away. Like you had the whole conversation in the same room. Yeah, I think a light's about to hit us, bro. With this soundtrack and the heartbeats. Uh-huh. Ooh, re-realizing it. Makes a lot of sense to me. Because I know it's me. This is good. This is good. Just tell her the honest explanation. Don't lie. She would appreciate this. This is gonna work. Oh, then she's gonna be like, wow. He got jealous. Why would he get jealous? Because he likes me. What are you doing? Am I remote control? <laughs> creepy stalker Riz. This is creepy stalker Riz. The ladies though. The fan club's getting cucked. Yo ladies, what's going on? Ichikawa is taken. Yeah, you didn't even have a chance. Is he gonna sing? He has to sing. Come on, speech boy, sing for us. <laughs> Isn't this the opening? This is literally our opening. He's singing it. Was it good? I, I think that uh, the speech was good, but the singing was. They're like, oh, 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 I, Yamada's like, oh my god, this is the best thing ever. But everyone else is like, okay, yeah, let's just go. Kanpai. Oh, Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, hold the fuck up. Let me change the headset for a second. What would Hara want? Probably to do with Kanzaki some voice talk. I'm not sure, but yeah. <laughs> Yamada is now fucking stalking us. Shows how much progress we've made where she's fucking looking through the back of the library case now. Sweet <laughs> paradise. Double day? Yeah. <laughs> でも、でも、でとじょ。いや、いつ。わかんないけど、神崎。あ、なんでだろう。さあ、まあ、2人ではなんとか遊びに行って。神崎making you guys think that each is the main character of this rom-com and sure he is, but like just realize that Kanzaki and Hara has made more progress in their romance than Dangerous in My Heart ever fucking will in the anime right now. I feel like Kazaki and Hara, they've been just doing their own shit on the side. It could be a whole fucking side story, man. <laughs> what? <laughs> but we've seen them together before. It's the same shit that we do. We act like a couple, do everything like a couple, but we're not a couple. Is that White Day? Is that White Day? I think it is. One month after February 14th. Now, you know what I low-key want? As we're on a double date, we see Adachi and Moiko also on a date somewhere else. Dude, 
if that fucking happens, if Adachi Moiko thing that got set up in Valentine's Day episode happens, like, holy shit. So, yeah, you got that. It's come. Double date. Double date. Make it a triple date with Adachi and Moiko. Shobu no ichinichi. Shobu no ichinichi. Damn, girl! Oh, shifuku. Is he trying to pick one up or is he just trying to get there early? <笑>やっぱり。なんでバレて考えれば考えるほどわからなくなる。ネットで検索すると。わかる。私じゃ力になれるかわかんないけど。it's Kawa and Hara? Yeah, we're not a couple by any means. We're not. We would need to have a comparison from season one where Hara and Ichikawa were like standing next to each other to see if he actually did grow. I don't know if they're slowly doing it. But... Mm, mm. Hara and Ichikawa are really getting along though. They for sure are. There's, there's no actual romance here, but they do get along. Yamada's <laughs> yeah, well, right behind. That does look cute. Yeah. Yamada ni boshika. Boom. Hey. Ooh. On you. It will look good on you. Yamada and Kanzaki both cocked at the same time. What the fuck? How? How is this happening right now? <laughs> Yamada got it. Yamada got it, but the Kanzaki. Yeah. He's happy about it. <laughs> he low key was kind of happy about it. Oh, she's jealous about me, you know? Finally. But uh, he's, he's always been jealous, but fucking Kanzaki broke a curse he's putting on us. <laughs> いつまで待ち合わせまいんね。え、可愛いよね。イエス。イエスね。感情が交錯している。悩む。オッケー、イズ<笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> What the fuck you want me to say? I feel like if I agree with you, you're gonna be like, Koros, Koros, Koros. He's gonna start cursing us again. What, 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 what do you want me to say? <laughs> no? Yes? I'm like, I am happy that you two are together. You two look great together. Go with the fucking safe answer. <laughs> Immediately! <laughs> Bro, come on! ハラさんはそそるな。そんな目で見るのはやめたまえ。おい、おい、どっかさっき、you're Sometimes girl well, if it was any other than a like, girl than Yamada, it might backfire. Cause like they wanna be a little self-conscious about each other and be like competing and you know, comparing and stuff like that. But Yamada eats a lot and she's very open to it. Maybe it kind of would enable Hara to eat a lot too. Harasan wa Ari no mama de Juvun Kawainda. Yeah. Once a minute. <laughs> We're getting a lot of these Yamada moments recently, bro, when she gets kind of like pissed off. Yeah. Wow. Hey, 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 stop! Why are we about to get a fucking light scene with Karti showing up between Ichikawa and Kanahara? Whoa, 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 stop. Holy, what are you, what are you doing right now? <laughs> Soundtrack changed. I know you have good intentions. Wow. 
Wow, a gift immediately. <laughs> you're making us look bad. <laughs> That's pretty cute. Hey. Oh, this is our opportunity to get mad at him. Fuck you, then. Chorus, chorus, chorus. This shit always happens. Or like we're having a conversation, then Yamada approaches from behind, and he says something, the accidental riz, the eavesdropping riz. Yamada wa ore no da! Dude, a flush animation was so detailed? Yamada wa ore no da! Boom! Yo. No, 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 come in! Come in! The. 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 Of course. Mm. The prime Ichikawa. He's so bad at taking compliments, but like your sense of like self respect, right? Self esteem is very low because of like his past, but he honestly. He's not that lacking. Recently, he's been really looking good. I mean, even though the other girls are like, wow, what's that speech guy? Huh? <laughs> I mean, it's horny kids, right? I mean, yeah, fuck, fine, but like, that's how much hot I'm used to you, though. No. Why is she not accepting? Because she's still nervous about it. They're in this weird limbo state where he's trying to confess and like ask her out, but she keeps acting like, oh, you're so funny. Appreciate that, wing woman. All right, now we're gonna get some alone time. Oh, what are the odds? Oh, the credits are playing already. What the fuck? It's still so far off. I think we're gonna get a post credit scene. Crepes! 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 Big crepe propaganda! Don't fall for it! It's the fucking politicians being bribed! The anime industry getting bribed by big crepe! <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. Let's get dinner together. Dinner! Come over, I don't know. No, don't forget! Wait, wait, he hasn't even given her the gift yet. It's white day. No, you still have to fucking do it. There's still a, quite a bit of episode left. I think there's gonna be a post credit scene. The credits are already rolling. Something huge should happen. That's relatable for everybody. <laughs> <laughs> he got me. I was like looking at it, looking at it. Where the fuck did that laugh come from? Hey, it's me. <laughs> What's up, me? Me! I trust in you! Carton 19. Yeah. Because he was protecting it, right? Because like he intentionally kept the bag from reaching when he got pushed there. But he has a gift in there. It's very sensitive. We're... We're what? We're dating? You in the train? You gonna do it in the train? We're overflowing! What's in there? What's in the bag? That's right, she spent the entire day stalling because she was kind of scared and worried about the intent of the chocolate and how he's going to receive it, right? So, come on, bro. You got to do it. 
There we go. It's basically muffin thing. White day. I think it's white choco muffin, right? I think it is. It's like the same kind, but white choco muffin. Never. Don't eat it one bite. might have a what a ring what is the what is this what the fuck is this? what 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 the fuck did he plant in the muffin the accessory imagine she fucking ate that bro imagine she fucking ate that in one fucking bite and then it's a gift to be gone it looks like a some kind of chain it has a dog bone on it some kind of accessory with a dog bone on it Ooh, fancy it's not weird she probably loves it. What's he doing? He just... He just got up and left? Alright, here's his gift. I know you think I'm creepy. I'm gonna go home now. Bye. Just straight up started walking away. Oh, the lights! The lights! We've already used our car tea today. Put it on me. Ooh, put it on me! <laughs> yeah, you want me to expose my fucking light when the fucking dangers in my heart shit comes up? So what? I do some shit like this, I'm like, ah! This is better. Yeah, that's the dangers of my heart special, bro. The light just fucking just goes crazy. Cool. She gonna keep that forever. No. So pretty. Oh, oh, oh. 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 More. More. Say here? So cute I could die, but I heard the word inu here. Did you hear it? Shinohodo kawaii. Shino inu. I I don't I I think that it's my lack of understanding Japanese that makes me conflate what he said to be a bit of uh, a match with a dog bone on her accessory, cause inu, dog. Nah nah, I think I'm schizo there. <laughs> Every episode you cry, don't lie to me. Okay, okay. I mean, he called her cute. We're overflowing. I mean, the episode kind of Kanzaki did the thing of like, you know, he compliments her, like he calls her cute every once a minute, right? This is our kind of deal. It wasn't really a confession. He says it in his own mind that I like her. Obviously, they both know they like each other, but hey, this is a step forward to say, so cute, I could die. Please don't do that, but hey. This accessory, I think she's gonna wear this for the rest of the season. And that's today's episode, man. Nice episode. We had a little bit, uh... Aftermath of the speech effect, you know? Yao Ichika is kind of becoming a celebrity at school. Eh, maybe that's a bit of a reach, but it is kind of cool to see other people flocking around and saying, Oh, you're that speech guy. The karaoke scene was also amazing. The transition from him singing awkwardly into the actual opening, fantastic. Then it was a double date episode. I wanted to see Adachi and Moiko though for White Day to see if Adachi would have actually done something. It would have been really cute. But this double date, a little bit of jealousy on both sides, you know. Ichika and Hara getting along too well. Kanzaki getting mad and baiting us was also fucking peak. And we gave her the gift. We gave her the gift and thank God she didn't eat all of it in one bite. And now with this accessory and by telling her, so cute I could die. We're making, you know, baby steps forward, but we're running out of time, man. I think that, uh, now what? We're a little bit over halfway finished with the season. Can we, uh, confession? Kiss? Hmm, I wonder at what kind of high note they're gonna end the season on. But hey, only one way to find out. 
Hey, but if you're still here though, and if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.